Hello, my name is Christian from TradeVola, trading with know-how and transparency. Like every week, we also want to discuss this week a new stock, a new symbol from our screening. If you want to see the latest video, you can check out here, Melco Resort and Entertainment. This was the stock from the last week with some recommendations. And if you don't want to miss any of the upcoming stocks, uh, make sure to subscribe here to our channel. We would be happy to welcome you for the next video here again. So what's the new symbol? What's the new stock? Uh, it's a quite volatile um, stock from China, from education. It's um, the symbol TAL, TAL Group, like I said, education and um, a stock from China. And now we want to check here all the details on our screen. Yeah, here we can see the chart of uh, TAL education and we already put some horizontal lines here. Depends if you want to wait for an outbreak above the last high, what we had here a little bit above uh, $10, then you can put a stop buy order here. In this case, I would recommend maybe to put a stop a little bit higher or also the target to increase it maybe to $16 or $17 because it's quite important for your chance risk ratio. But uh, what we can see and what I already told you in the beginning, it's a quite volatile um, stock. And if we go back in the past for the last two years, we will also see some more movement here. And most important, I think 2021 was a very long downtrend for the stock itself. From the highest value of $90, it went almost down to $2. And the last year, 2022, it was one of the stocks what had a really good and positive performance, but we have to see yeah, what happened before. And I think this chart shows it quite easily. And I think it's um, yeah, still a good price for an investment. And what was the reason for this? It was, we can show it here, we got a quite high call option volume yesterday. Today we have only 1,300 calls at the moment. But if we check yesterday, it was more than 70,000 call options. And to have a quick look in our scan, there was different um, strike prices. $7.50 for next week, 20 of um, January. Then we have also $14 for February, what we used as a target. But I think this option, what runs till May and the strike price of $10, must be one of the yeah, easy and good ways to participate from the um, yeah, good movement here in T TAL. What else is important for TAL? As always, we will also show you strategy here on TradingView. Here we can also see the lowest price what we had was $1.60. And this um, yeah, was not so far away. It was um, last year in March. So that's what I said in 2022, most of the stocks had negative uh, performance and uh, TAL was one of the positive um, stocks. What we need to know as well is uh, the earnings are coming soon. Like I said, it's a um, stock from China, education and training services. Earnings will be announced next Thursday before the market opens on the 19th. We can, as we already see, um, or so on the screen, of course, trade um, options on it and the stock itself is also shortable. Market capitalization, we will see it here. It's 5.3 billion. I think it's important to also have a look here at the screen. We see a few upgrades in the last year, but the prices from the upgrade itself were almost reached here. And I think what was an interesting article from Yahoo Finance about the TAL education is um, here, where we can see the sex sector rank. And in this case, TAL education is currently sporting a sex rank of um, two. What is um, a buy? And what is always important is to compare this with yeah, consumer or with um, the field where it's investing or um, with education and consumer titles in general. It was, like I said already earlier, performing much better. Most of the companies had an average of minus 35%. 
but as I said, important was to see the period of time before where it had um, yeah almost 95% down movement in 2021. But we will put you this article as well in the description so you can check also the details here because it's quite interesting if you really want to invest in this stock. And another interesting article was from yesterday where which you also find in Finvis here. It was about the investors that 44% of all stocks are yeah, held by in institutional investors. What is important to know and the link as well you will find also here in our description. Quite interesting as I said in the beginning and also here an overview about all the important um, stuff what we mostly showed you already. I think there's some interesting information from the price. I think we saw it already in the chart but especially here what happened in one year, what happened in the last seven days. It also shows that especially if we see here the last seven days how volatile it is but the last year 172% was definitely outstanding movement of the company. Also when it was founded how many employees it's a quite good overview of all the details what we saw also in Finvis it's uh, market capitalization you also have the information about the next earnings what happened in the last earnings um, and all this information you also find here as well like i said we try to put all these links all this information together in the description so that you will not miss any of the details itself and for the end we will have another look here on our chart um, especially if we take a closer look here in the weekly chart i think what is definitely possible that um, the stock will move back in a level where it was before Corona. Because like every stock after Corona, it almost doubled till the beginning of 2021. Then this outstanding down move came and I think a price target of $20. So still from the price uh, what we see now will be more than double. Is possible for the next uh, few weeks and months. Um, and as I said, Earlier, you can wait here for a breakout above the last high, but it can also happen with a gap. You don't know, notice yet um, when the next earnings will be um, announced. But for example, I think this was must be around the last earnings. So it's not a stock with a really high gap, but as we saw it already yesterday, there was also quite big gap. So this can be the disadvantage if you really want to wait for a breakout otherwise um, you can also invest like we mentioned it in the beginning with the same price what we will also show you in our trading view setup yeah i think it's uh, even it's quite volatile it was an interesting stock i think there's still a good chance uh, for a breakout in the next weeks and like I always said also for the last videos, we will make sure to give you also an overview about all the symbols, what we recommended here, what happened to the stocks, uh, how many percentage they made in the last weeks. And um, yeah, for this, just make sure to subscribe our channel to not miss any of these videos. You can also check here our performance of our ETF strategy, what we also represent every month. So just enjoy the other videos on our channel and I hope to welcome you here soon again. Thank you very much.